Last June, Greens members elected me to fill a casual vacancy and be their next Greens MP. And though it's been a sharp learning curve, in just eight short months, we've built some real momentum. I've brought together women's groups, activists, and politicians from all sides to fight against those who would treat women's rights as a political plaything. I've worked with the cross-party working group to bring about the first vote on same-sex marriage in New South Wales and spoken out for the trans and intersex community. I've exposed government deception over the West Connex motorway and given an expert voice to growing support for world-class public transport systems that offer viable alternatives to expensive toll roads. With our ecosystems under attack from an ignorant government, I am proud to be an MP who stands with our inspiring activists on the front line to stop environmental destruction. On these issues and those in my other seven portfolios, I've spoken at local and national rallies, hosted community forums, written opinion pieces, and connected with 4,000 Facebook fans on a daily basis. I've been published in everything from multicultural media to suburban weeklies to the international reach of Time magazine. And recently, I was honored to be selected as one of Fairfax Media's 2013 Women of the Year. I am proud of these achievements because it means that people are listening to us. It means that more and more the diverse experiences and passions of our great Greens members are being heard. In my visits to local groups all over the state, you've welcomed me warmly and made one thing very clear. Your ideas will be the force that shapes the future. The 2015 state election is an opportunity for us to build on those ideas and develop a sustainable and just vision for New South Wales. I want us to organise our local communities and stand shoulder to shoulder with teachers, nurses, firefighters and workers across the state who are feeling the brunt of this government's attacks on our public services. By working together, we can give the people of New South Wales the progressive alternative they deserve, a vision for a better and fairer society, a flourishing and protected natural environment, and equal rights for all, regardless of gender or sexuality. I'm an academic and an engineer, and I believe in ecologically sustainable, evidence-based solutions. I'm an advocate and an activist. I know that the strongest voices don't belong to those who shout the loudest, but those who listen and can unite people for equality and justice. I'm a migrant and a mother. I want to live in a country that gives all people the opportunity to make a better life for their family. And thanks to your support eight months ago, I'm a Greens MP. Working together, we've had some really good wins and built real momentum, but there's much more to do. That's why I'm asking for your support in the Greens New South Wales pre-selection for our Legislative Council ticket, so we can continue turning your ideas into real progress for New South Wales.